Amazon owes you money and you just have to ask for it sometimes, specifically in asking for a reimbursement for something they damaged or was lost. My name is Stephen Pope and I'm the founder of My Amazon Guy. In this video, I'm going to walk you through how to quickly get hundreds and possibly thousands of dollars out of Amazon with just minutes of effort and I'm not selling anything. If you go over into Amazon Seller Central, and I'm going to put this link at the top of the video as well as the top comment here. This is a section on FBA inventory reimbursements. Scroll all the way down to the bottom, and in here, you're going to see two sections where you can add either a transaction ID or type in an FN SKU to request reimbursement for challenged items. So I'm going to hit refresh on this page so you can kind of see this in real action here. And when I scroll to the bottom here, I'm going to show you the FN SKU one first. This is the easier of them. All you have to do is simply add in the FN SKU for each one of your items that are at FBA. So here's one of my items here. I just hit continue and it's going to run a report to see anything that's been lost recently. So four items were lost. They were recently found. And so they're, they're, there's nothing to get credited for on this particular item. If there was... I'd hit create a case and I'd be off to the races within hours to get money directly back out of Amazon. The second method is more time consuming. So be ready for this one. I'm going to give you another link where you're going to go over into the FBA inventory adjustments report. So to get here, you're going to put your cursor over reports, go to fulfillment. On the left hand side, the inventory drop down, you're going to have to hit the more button so that it shows all of the additional files. There's so many different reports you can run out of Amazon. It's, it's crazy. Click on inventory adjustments. Now, again, this link is going to be at the top of the video just to make it easy for you. You can just click the link directly if you prefer. In here, you're going to go over to the download section. And we do this about once a month. Um, now, in here, you can download a CSV, which will give you a list of transactions. When you open up the Excel file or CSV, in here you're going to see all sorts of FN SKU data, SKUs, the product name, as well as an adjusted transaction ID number. In here, these numbers will show next to them what happened, what was the disposition. So an item that might have been lost or an item that was returned ended up back into sellable condition. In here, here's an example of warehouse damaged. So if we were to take this transaction ID and go back into Amazon, you'll then take that transaction ID and type it in here and hit check status. This particular one we filed last night and we've already been reimbursed. And so I'll show you that. Here's an example of one of the cases we filed last night. Already got reimbursed like 50 bucks here, might be even a little bit more than 50 bucks. Uh, on several transaction IDs. Now, when you file these, I do recommend that you limit it to five transactions at a time to get optimal return results on these. But if you look at how we filed this, it was as simple as just simply typing in five transaction IDs and investigate. We didn't even ask for reimbursement. We just said, hey, investigate this, and they, and they do reimburse you. I would, I would put the word, hey, can we get reimbursed for these lost um, items or add some details in. Now, this back to that Excel file, there are over 2,100 uh, inventory adjustments on this particular file. And that was from a date range of November all the way back to May. That's a lot of transactions, right? And if you were trying to do this manually going five at a time, you might be looking at a couple hours of effort. But it's worth it because in a couple hours of effort, you're going to get hundreds of dollars back, if not thousands. And again, we just filed this last night and it went through in the morning, and I woke up today seeing the ticket responses, and I was like, hey, there's 50 bucks there, there's eight bucks there, hey, that's a $200 ticket. Pretty nice to walk up, wake up, and get some additional funds in my pocket. But it's a lot of work. So we partner up with a, uh, a company called My Refund Guy to run these automatically for you. First 500 bucks, that's on the house, just to prove that it works, and then we charge 25% commission thereafter. Again, you could follow the tutorial in this video, do all of this for free, and run it yourself. Or you could check us out, hire us, we'd be happy to do it for you too. Anything that's lost, damaged, refunds, mishandled returns, lost inbound shipments, all done, every case, every FN SKU, we fight tooth and nail because uh, those are dollars that we'll, we'll get back for you, 
and we'll take a, a small cut reward with you on that. My name is Stephen Pope. I'm the founder of My Amazon Guy, and we talk about everything we can to grow sales on Amazon, solve problems. Check out these videos on everything from PPC, SEO, design, and catalog. And by the way, we just celebrated 100 employees hired at My Amazon Guy. If you want a job in e-commerce, in Amazon specifically, and you're just watching this video, send, it, send your resume over to jobs at myamazonguy.com. We're always hiring. You can see some of our jobs at myamazonguy.com slash jobs and check them out there. Um, 100 employees, that's 100 jobs made in the last uh, three years, generating it from, from building up the ground all the way until we've got 100 employees. So Amazon specialists, account managers, directors, advertising. This is both U.S.-based and international jobs. We also have some remote jobs as well. We'll see you later.